hey y'all welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're interested in seeing what i made for this week then just keep on watching i got this wreath ring and this welcome sign from the dollar tree and for now i'm going to leave this jute cord on the welcome sign just in case if I need it later. So now I'm just gonna take my gold metallic spray paint and I'm gonna cover both of them. I'm gonna be using this Mod Podge and this gold glitter to create a mixture for my welcome sign. Since this gold glitter on my pumpkin does not quite match with my gold glitter in the tube, I'm going to be using that same mixture to cover all three of my pumpkins. Now I'm going to be using these flowers and these faux leather pumpkins and also the glitter pumpkins and these pumpkins have these clip things on the back so I'm just going to clip those on and then glue everything else onto my wreath ring. For this last step, I'm using these photo clip string lights and I'm just feeding it through my wreath. These colors were a perfect combination for my fall decor and I'm absolutely loving it. But tell me what y'all think down in the comments. I used these four canvases in a previous project and I figured why not use them again since they can be reused. So now I'm just taking my silver sharpie and I'm gonna spell the word welcome on my canvases.
I'm basically using the same items as I did for my wreath to decorate my welcome sign. I think my welcome sign is just as cute and glam as my wreath, but tell me what y'all think down in the comments. For this last project, I'm using these gold frames and I'm gonna start off by removing the backing and then I'm gonna glue it into a box shape. I'm using this old foam board to trace a rectangle for the bottom of my box. Once I was done filling my box with all my decor, I removed any excess glue strings, cleaned my frames off, and then I had something that looked like this. I really love how all three of my projects turned out, but tell me what y'all think. Please like, comment, and share. And if you're curious to see what else I can create, hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you don't miss my next video.